Hi everybody, this is Rita with Broomstitch. Welcome to my channel. Thank you for being here. I uh, don't want to take too much of your time. Uh, I don't know how long this video is going to be, but um, I wanted to share with you my first of the four big journals that I told you about in the last video. I mentioned in the last video that instead of creating one big Christmas journal this year, I decided to do four regular, um, meaning non-Christmas uh, themed uh, journals. And um, before I, I show you this one, the one that I completed, uh, sorry about the shadows here. Let me see if I can do something. I don't know if that helped, but uh, <laughs> sorry about that. It's not really helping, is it? Oh, dang. Well, sorry about that. Uh, I'm not sure what to do as far as the shadows go um, this afternoon sun, but this is like really bad. Really, really, I'm not, I'm not liking the shadow effect here, but I try to do my best to show you the details uh, in this journal. And maybe if I turn this a little bit, let me see. Okay, maybe maybe this will be better. But um, also I talked about these little fat, fat journals that I completed, uh, my little fat journals. There are several that sold. There's a few more available. Um, I did a video on one of them uh, in the last video. So yeah, they are at a very reasonable price. Uh, for a limited time, and then I'm probably going to raise the price on them. Um, but, yeah, uh, as far as what's going on with these four big journals that I'm creating, I am stuffing as much of my crafting materials into them as I can, and techniques and, and everything. They are more on the grungy side. Um, I'm burned out. And I want to use up as much of my material as possible because I'm going to be taking some time off from journal making. Um, I'm not sure when I'm going to be making big journals again. Not in the foreseeable future. Future. So going into the new year, I am trying to finish up this new year with using up as much of my material as possible. So these are crammed. I mean, crammed with a lot of original ephemera, a lot of my, a lot of my stuff in here um, that you will see. Um, each of these four big journals. This is the first one that I completed, and I'm doing a video about this one. So this is the cover, and again, you're not going to be able to see everything in this video. Um, I have pictures in my eBay shop. This is listed already in my eBay shop, but of course. I'm not going to show everything either. Um, I want some of the things to be surprised. A lot of these are, a lot of these pages have hidden, there are hidden pockets and uh, tuck spots and things like that that you have to discover for yourself. And there's a lot of material that went into these. A um, lot of grunginess, coffee dyed laces and appliques and Oh, I love this kitty. This is a wedding dress applique. And this is a journal that you can't really close. Um, you have to like tie it together to close it and uh, uh, or stand it up like this to display somehow because there's just too much in it. Lots of original ephemera I've been using. This is a pocket full of stuff, envelope, beautiful envelope. And I'm just kind of flip through it. Uh, I'm hoping to get another one done this week. The second one of the four. And list it. I'm not sure if I'm going to do a video about that one or not. So this is a little paper doll that I created. This has moving parts. You can use this to remove it uh, from the journal. So th these are just held in, held in and it has little moving parts. It's a really cute one. Um, this has it's been gessoed and so it's pieced together. It has a pearl on its head. It's a kitty. Like, uh, 
I don't know what you would call it, what kind of style kitty it is, but it's it's a cardstock. I made it out of cardstock. Yeah, I made this a long time ago. <laughs> okay, lots of collaging. This is a little, actual little mini journal that you can take out and use with blank pages. Beautiful charm. Lots of charm, charms in here too. Oh, this is a really old. Oh, I'm not gonna. I, I don't wanna tell you what's inside because it's it's adorable. Um, but this is used to be a needle book. Really, really beautiful. Black. Uh, this is black with gold detail, and I I think it's gorgeous. I removed the needles and put something else in there instead. Pocket. Lots of original ephemera in here. And lots of crunchy papers, too. Yeah, pockets, goodies in here. I'm not sure where this one goes. I don't think I just had that sitting here by itself. I'm just going to stick it in here. I think it's, a, it's just a little uh, booklet type that goes in here. Okay. Oh, I know. Yeah, there is a clip that goes with this clipped in there okay yeah i have to find it um and then this is a big envelope oh yeah i need to put more stuff in there this what happened to the stuff that was in here i lost it but this has this will have more more things in it that envelope and this was also clipped in here i'm gonna fix that and hmm yeah i have to fix that just threw me off. Oh, this is so cute, this little no pocket. Adorable, adorable. Lace samplers, vintage buttons, uh, button card in here, more of the wedding dress appliques. These are original uh, postcards and greeting cards, Christmas ones. Uh, big flashcards, original flashcards. This is a beautiful uh, collage envelope that I made and and that's the end of it just quickly running through this obviously i probably only showed you like less than half of the stuff that's in here so i just wanted to give you a taste of what's going on um the um second one i started already this is the second one okay this is 2 30 in the afternoon this is not a good time to make a video i need to make a note of this I'm going to have to do it later in the day. Um, yeah, I started this. Working on that second one. This is going to be the third one. And then the last one is going to be this one. So, yeah. I'm going to try to make the next video at a better time of the day. But this is, as you know, really shabby. Really, as far as... Things are hanging out. There are different levels, uh, gradual uh, and waterfall, waterfall effects, and just all kinds of craziness. <laughs> craziness going on in here. So yeah, um, please look at the pictures in my eBay shop and uh, you'll get a better idea. I have a bunch of pictures uploaded in there. And I have to find my clip that was in here and see what is going on with that. So thank you so much for uh, hanging with me. Remember, I have these um, teeny tiny, not teeny tiny, they are not that teeny tiny, fat, little fat journals listed, a few more of those left. If you're interested, uh, the price will be going up on those. And that's it. Um, if I have anything else, I will be uh, doing a video about that. Again, when I have the second journal done, I'm probably going to do a video. Yes, I'll, I'll do a video about this when it's done. But right now, this is the first one and it's available. Thank you so much. Peace out.